couple of runs this season from the service area, but that one is going to be an ace for her as that one snuck along the line there, David. Yeah, to me, I actually. Bishop puts it in play. And Maria Mosbacher elevates and slams that one down, David. Yes, yeah, she did with a, a lot of emphasis on that, Andrew. She but with a lot of work to do, digging themselves a 2-0 hole in sets. Another block there from Duquesne. Corey Johnson going up to get that one. I just mentioned how important it's going to be to get her involved. And there for Davidson. Tipped up. Suter. Becerra sets. Basilak. And that one's going to be a point for the Dukes, and they take this third set, David. Yes, they do. And a well-deserved win that was. They came out of the gate strong, made the necessary adjustments. They were able to pull that one out. Off and force a fifth set. Becerra. Suter. Trezak in play, point Duquesne as that one snuck inside that end line to give the Dukes another point and a timeout called by Davidson. Abby Trezak is back, Andrew. We fifth set, fifth and, deci and decisive, I should say. Blocked there by Johnson and a point for the Dukes and they force that fifth set climbing out of a 2-0 hole to tie it up at two sets apiece, David. Yeah, and Andrew, earlier today I... Bell. Davitt, and Molly Davitt gets the point for the Dukes, and an important one as well. Cockrell, a dugout by Davitt, nice dig by her. And the point there for Duquesne, and they battle back from a two to zero set deficit and win three to two here inside the AJ Palumbo Center. What an effort from the Dukes, Andrew, and a fun effort it was. The Dukes 